So, are we ready? Digman News. Why, people don't want to see me dancing? I need more coffee! Hello, Digmates, and welcome to a Digma News special full of good news. We've started shipping the Digma Defy keyboards, we've released new wireless features, we just launched a new version of Basecore, and we have a bit of news regarding the Digma Rays. Let's start with the greatest news. We shipped 500 Defy keyboards last week and some have already arrived at their destination. We've started sending full spec black keyboards, but not all of them have been sent yet. If you're one of the lucky 500, you should have received an email with a tracking number. But if you haven't, don't worry, shipping will continue next week, as this week is the National Day Golden Week in China. Yup, the National Day Golden Week. You heard it first here. So shipment will extend for the following four to six weeks. As a reminder, we are fulfilling and shipping keyboards in sub batches of different configurations, depending on what's best to ensure maximum efficiency and accuracy. That's defined by the assembly factory based on a gazillion factors that change daily. So as much as we'd love to be able to share with you what's being done next, we can't. However, you can join the party on Discord where we share whatever info we have on what's being shipped at the moment. You can also ask again and again about the status of your specific configuration and we'll kindly answer what we know. Another great news is that we've added new wireless features for the Defy. You can now pair the Defy with up to five Bluetooth devices and easily swap between them, thanks to the new user interface or UI on the keyboard itself. When you plug the neuron into the back of the keyboard, you'll see five blue lights light up in the number row on both halves. Each one represents one device. Select the desired channel, let's say one, and it'll start pulsing. Then go to your computer and select it in the Bluetooth preferences. It'll show the name you assigned to your keyboard and the channel. Once you've assigned multiple devices, you'll start seeing more colors in that UI. Blue means available channel, white means assigned channel, green means active channel, and if you hold the red key under each channel, it'll reset it. You can also access the Bluetooth pairing mode by pressing the Bluetooth pairing key, which you can assign in Basecore. Right now, your paired devices will reset when you update your firmware, but we're working on fixing that and being able to manage your devices on Basecore. We're also working on being able to use Basecore over Bluetooth. Right now, it works through RF or radio frequency and wired. Another wireless feature we've implemented is the possibility to have different LED brightness when you use the keyboard in RF or Bluetooth, as well as other battery management options. To use these features, you need to have Basecore 1.3.4 installed and update your firmware to the latest available version. Which takes me to the next bit of news. We've released a new version of our configurator software, Basecore 1.3.4, which includes the necessary UI to manage the new wireless features, but also other necessary updates. There's an improved battery reading and battery status for the Defy. We've included an independent English UK layout. Before, you would get English US or UK depending on whether your keyboard was ISO or ANSI, which obviously doesn't work for the Defy. We've improved the keyboard selection screen while multiple keyboards are connected. We've revamped the flashing procedure with new instructions and a new user interface that guides you through the process. We also fixed a bug where the firmware update process wouldn't start if your top left key was not escape. We also fixed some minor UI bugs and we have finally launched a native Mac OS ARM native version. Finally, I'm going to address the elephant in the room that many of you have asked about. What's happening with the Digma Race? Well, right now we're out of stock of black and silver Digma Race keyboards and we don't even have an ETA on the restock. But don't worry, we still have limited edition colors. The timing hasn't been great because most of our efforts are focused on shipping the Defy. But now that that's rolling, we'll be able to update you on the race in a couple of weeks. So don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel. You don't want to miss that. Trust me. To make up for that, we've extended the end of summer promo and you can get a limited edition Digma race at the same price as a black or silver one. That's $70 off. You'll have a keyboard that'll just blow your mind. And that's it. That's the end of the Digma News special tonight. All night.
But before we end, we just want to greet a happy birthday to one of our digmates, Oren. Thank you so much for believing in us and pre-ordering your Digma Defy. I hope your invisible keyboard arrives soon so that you can enjoy the magic of the Digma Defy on your desk. Okay, bye! And you'll have a keyboard that'll blow your head away and you'll have a keyboard that'll blow your tits off and you'll have a keyboard that'll make all the ladies jump into your bed all the ladies go wet you have to have a mop to wipe everything you'll have a keyboard that'll give you more energy more passion more energy more power more energy